Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week, Microsoft rolled out their latest Windows 11 Canary Channel inside of Build 26217. And just to let you know about a new feature that Microsoft um, has actually added to the original release notes, which was originally not actually listed as a new feature. And this is a new feature that's been hidden as a hidden feature uh, in Insider Builds since quite some time ago and is now finally rolling out in, as an official feature in last week's Canary Channel Build. And if we head over to the update, we can see on the 16th, they mentioned we are beginning to roll out updated visuals for the Rename Your PC and Change Date and Time dialogs to match the Windows 11 visuals. And um, this was actually spotted by Phantom Ocean 3, who has posted uh, some screenshots over on X regarding these updated visuals. And this is the updated dialog for renaming your PC, as we can see. So looking a little bit more modern to match the look and feel of Windows 11. And if we head to change date and time, the same applies. So that's now officially been tested in the Canary channel. So there's a good chance that this will roll out with Windows 11 24H2 or even possibly sooner with, you know, just a, an update to Windows 11 in the stable channel. Now, just to put this all into context, uh, if I head over quickly in the stable version to my settings and we head to the system page and we go right down to the bottom to the about yeah we can see the um the current dialog for renaming your pc and we can see looking a little bit more like windows 8 a little bit more legacy compared to uh, the uh, new dialog so just to bring that up once again so that's the this is the new the new dialog for renaming your pc so we can see that uh looks a little bit more modern compared to how it currently is and then uh, in settings if we head to our time and language and we head to date and time and if you have set time automatically we just toggle that off and then you click on change and here you can see change date and time so currently in the stable looking a little bit legacy a little bit more like windows 8 i would suggest and if we head back to the update yeah we can see change date and time and i think that looks a lot better just to collate and fit in with the current windows 11 look and feel so um two small little changes i mean um, most users most probably wouldn't even notice that but i thought um, i'll just bring that to your attention because that is now listed and um, those two changes are now listed as an official update in last week's Canary Channel Ball 26217. And as mentioned, a good chance those will be rolling out um, soon. And if not soon, that will make the 24H2 feature update. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.